why the hell do we still have kickers in the NFL? I think that we need to eliminate kickers from the NFL and it will improve the game immeasurably. And a lot of you might be gasping right now, but the reality is big changes are the ones that we remember the most. And I know it sounds like a lot now, but they used to play in leather helmets and no pads and now they have pads. Like this game should have to evolve. And I will tell you this, it is, I, I, you don't even get a good feeling from watching them make those field goals. If he makes that field goal, it's a relief. Okay, wow, I'm glad we did that. But it's like this weird other thing that needs to happen for the football game to be a success. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, Can I give you my list of reasons why I would think that or you want to play off me first? No, go ahead, my dude. All right, so these are the reasons why because I know you guys are coming at me in the comments already. I can hear your little fingers typing. But one, it would make every fourth down more intense. If you don't have the option to kick field goals. Now, I think you still have punters or whatever, but field goals, it would make them have to go for fourth down every time. And I do not know why the idea of wanting more football in football is a bad idea. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Fantasy football players would get an extra down each drive. And I know all you fantasy football players out there, that might be the biggest reason. That's fair. You know what I mean? I think that yeah. would be an awesome ad. Like, you know, no one cares about the kickers on their team. If your running back gets an extra run, your quarterback gets an extra throw, those things add up. It would make the game way more dynamic for fantasy players. All right. Um, the entire game wouldn't ride, like I said, on a position that is not involved 95% of the time. <laughs> yeah. And it would make coaches game plan a lot more aggressively, I believe. Oh, because like more fun? Yeah, more fun. You don't have the option of default. And like I said- Like, like how you did on Madden and busting my ass for years? <laughs> you yeah. go real aggressive. That tight end cross the cross. <laughs> it, it was the clear out route with the slot receiver crossing over the middle where they all just, just go Hail Marys. <laughs> yeah. Just don't know nothing about defense. You just cook at me. <laughs> and even when I started letting you plug in the controller, I still kept getting <laughs> yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, this is my last point. I, I, but basically, I think kicking is like fast food. You get a quick hit of adrenaline because you know something is going to happen. Like, you know, you're more guaranteed to see a point happen right there in that yeah. moment. But after, even if it goes in, the feeling is not good. You know, like it's, it's unsatisfying. It's unsatisfying. You're just, you're just, it's like being in a car and being glad that you just barely missed that other car. You don't really feel like you gained anything. You're just like, okay, we got three. We didn't lose. It's like a participation trophy. Like you came in third place at the science fair. Hmm. That's interesting. I like that argument. That's a, I've, uh, do, you have, do you have a side on this? Do you, do you, do you feel like I'm bugging? Do you feel... I like feel like you were, you're not bugging in terms of if we were redesigning the sport, but I feel like at this point, all right, so do we do kickoffs still? Do we I start? do kickoffs. I'd say kickoffs and punts. I think just get rid of field, field goal goals. kicking. Okay. And again, it sounds they are crazy. The highest, they're the highest scoring player on, on any football team though. So that's a ridiculous thing to happen considering yeah. they're not on the field most of the, most time. Of the time. And reality is they eliminated, they weren't, they weren't allowed to dunk at one point in the NBA. They didn't yeah. have the three point line at one point in the NBA. They didn't have 18 games in the NFL at one point. Like they, they, these things change. These are businesses at the end of the day. Yeah. And any good business is back to what we were talking about, the blank that built America. Any good business you will know is always evolving and always going to the future. So what I say may sound crazy, but I think 15 years from now, the NFL would be a more, even more enjoyable product if you got rid of these dudes. Huh. I just feel like it would so much fundamentally change the game that I don't think they would, one, they would ever do it, but like, that's not where if we're talking realism, but two, I don't know. I think it adds kind of an extra element after a touchdown after, or instead of, or if I can't get all this, you still got to come and block. Like, I don't know. There's still a chance. It just gives them an extra chance to come back. You know what I mean? But it's more fun. I, I get that. It's like, like you're like, never I get out that. of it. You're right. The 40-yard line all of a sudden becomes a lot less hopeful. Yeah. But it also, again, sacrifices for gains. It also means that every second, every after a touchdown, you get to see a two-point conversion every time. And that's really exciting. And that's going to add a lot more variable to games. Yeah, I think if they do it, they got to push back. The, they got to get bring back kickoffs. So they they're, every every game I watch, every football game, since they changed the rule of where you kick from, kickoffs just don't mean shit. It either goes in the back of the end zone or he waves his hand and it's a fair catch in the end zone. Because any kicker can, if we're being realistic, can kick 
at 80 yeah. yards and wherever. Yeah, no, 100%. So it's player safety. So I, I yeah, I, like you're not running at each other full. So I think it's stupid though. Cause like we do it some of the time. Yeah. Like with the trend of the league, I'd say they'd probably be turning more to kicking if we're if we're being on like more to field goals and stuff just because they're like def- they're they're not allowed to play defense as well as they used to be. But I also don't know if they took away kinking if defense would defense like they so if they made put more they could put more theoretically they could put more restrictions on the defense which made it easier to score in other ways so by touchdowns yeah which they already are kind of doing they, yeah they've been doing they've that. been doing that a lot and it's harder for defense to play defense so basically you'd need to even up ramp that up to the uh, higher extent if i feel like if you got rid of field goals yeah and then but some changes would have to be made yeah but then you'd lose like the brutality of football which is what we all love <laughs> like if Wait, you're trying honest. to tell me that getting rid of kickers would lose the because they bring the brutality of football no the i'm saying it's like the soccer players in pads it's well i'm not no i'm not saying it's it's like, why are we sending money to Ukraine? It's not that we're scared of Ukraine. It's that we're scared of what happens. It's the fallout from that. So it's take away kickers, and then you have to score only by this, only by offense. <laughs> so the reason that they probably ha- had kickers when they first were cr- building the game, creating the game, because it wasn't like Naismith. He didn't have his own thing. But when they were building the game, the reason they had kickers was because at a certain part, it would be like a low so you could just have a zero zero game well, that's back when they weren't nearly as good at football either that's true um it's i like will also say this yeah. i think kickers are like ukraine and we're told <laughs> we're told they're way more important than they actually are you know <laughs> yeah because fuck homeless people in our country we need to help never mind we're yep, not gonna not, get into yep, that yep. <laughs> yeah but i'm with you big dog uh, <laughs> you know that all, all i'm saying is and to your point about people would be upset or whatever Remember what we talked about earlier in the, sh- in the in the show about how addicted Americans are to football? Are you yeah. trying to tell me that if we got rid of kickers in the NFL, people would stop wanting to watch the NFL? They would stop liking it? No, nah, that's a fact. People, I mean, I was supporting the kneeling, of course, but people were kneeling and half the fan base got upset. They still watched the games. If politics can't divide people on football, you think getting rid of the player that no one wants to wear the jersey of would? <laughs> I guess you're right. It's like if every team had a Trey Young on there, they just yeah. they're only good at shooting or only good at kicking. <laughs> it's this, a purely skill sport. This show is the show of the future. So we're not bringing you these takes and telling you what's going on now all the time. I am telling you what should happen in the future. I am bringing all of us into what the NFL in the future should look like. And if they don't want to listen to me, it's fine. You're wrong, but you're fine. You know what I mean? They're still, they could still have kickers in the league and it'll be fine. No one will ever have a problem. But I think if you were to make the change 25 years, years from now, you'd look back and be like, wow, that was a great move. It's a really great move. I don't know why we just, I don't know why we did that. We just, we did it and we didn't realize we weren't doing it. We all have things like that in our lives that we did for years and then we stopped doing it. And you're like, why? Why did I do that? Um, mo- usually they're lovers, but it could be more innocuous things too. Hmm. I'm just saying. No, I, I'm give kind the kicker of, the boot. I'm kind of. <laughs> 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 I'm kind of stepping on your little bandwagon. I don't know. Fuck kickers, right? Yeah, right. Although I don't know. I think there's football is without many non skill players, it's kind of refreshing to have a pure skill player. Like he don't he's not on there all the time. Like I don't know. Well, are they even skilled? Due to the Bills just fucking <laughs> His whole life's work is to just make to that, field, that field, goal, field goal. And he missed it. And I get it, pro sports is hard and stuff, but dog, if that's the only thing you do, imagine being on a basketball team and you're brought in to be the free throw shooter. And you miss free throws? It's like, it's like when you're, I don't know, <laughs> it's like baseball. Like, how can you not hit the ball, bro? <laughs> like, I get, well, I, I get that like, too, but at least it's because you have the other guy trying to get better at throwing yeah, it. He's getting better at throwing it. But, but like, the NFL kickers aren't like that. They're getting the same hikes and like whatever that they've been getting. Yeah. And they have a different ball even to kick the football. They do? Yeah, it's a kicking ball. Get the fuck out of the year, kicker. Yo, you got a different ball to play with, you yeah. pussy ass bitches. Kick the regular shit. Yeah. Yo, get them out of here. Get, get them out of here. here. Fuck out of here. We yeah. done with we this. Done with this. Kickers, you suck. <laughs>